We're experiencing the Bryce Canyon area by Pedal Power today on At Your Leisure. And we're discovering some surprising beauty and interesting pit stops along the way. I'm Darren Kinder. Jill and I set out in search of adventure, and it isn't long until we find what we're after. Then travel reporter Zach Cipriano rides one ATV jamboree that is bridging the gap between city and country. Finally, Reestein goes urban and learns why fisheries in the city are growing like never before. Own the outdoors now with At Your Leisure. Welcome to At Your Leisure, I'm Darren Kinder. And I'm Jill Kinder, and we're here in Garfield County, just off of Scenic Highway 12. We're at Bryce Wildlife Adventure, and there is so much to do here. We're excited to see everything and do fun stuff. Yeah, there's, you know, you can go mountain biking here, you can go road biking, they got a really cool trail, they got ATV adventures, there's 160 miles worth of trails around here to go ride on, and they got this really cool museum that we're gonna check out. And that's what we're doing now. I, I came from the old country, from Holland, and when I was 16 years old, I went with a couple of friends of mine and we went deer hunting and I got a nice deer and I mounted it and that was my goal. Since I was 16 and I'm going to be 70, I've been at this almost 54 years. And every animal we taxidermied, we tried to do it in the natural habitat. I tried to make all the plants are real, all the cactus is freeze-dried, even the scat's real. We've got 1,100 animals in the museum, 1,600 butterflies. We have an African room, Alaska, Indian artifacts, just about everything you can think of. The place is completely full. We also have lots of animals on the property, miniature donkeys, chickens, the deer, uh, so the kids can hand feed them and enjoy it. We started with the ATV business and we have uh, about 16 family units, singles and doubles. We just take them to the trailhead and I show them the prairie dogs and I take their picture and we like to do it in it's Aquarius Mountain. That plateau is the tallest plateau in North America. It's 10,800 feet high. And now that the bicycle trail is finished, uh, it's only a year old. It goes all the way into the Bryce Canyon National Park, to all the beautiful views, Fairyland, Sunrise Point, Sunset Point, Inspiration Point, Bryce. And then what's nice, coming back, it is a 1,200 foot slowly and the 10 miles coming down, so it's not always pumping uphill. And now that the weather is getting a little nicer, we hope uh, that the trail will pick up because it's absolutely gorgeous. Not a pothole, it's all brand new. The county got involved, the Forest Service got involved. Uh, it's a nice ride. We have just finished learning about Bryce Wildlife Adventure, and this is part of the adventure, is getting to feed the deer. So, that, yeah, it's a, <laughs> and they're yeah. very hungry. That museum was fantastic. Oh, There's so amazing. many things. You can spend a whole day just hanging out in that place. You bet, it is just amazing. This is a fabulous place, and the deer are just ravenous, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> they like their treats. While we're finishing up feeding the deer, why don't you take a look at our travel adventure? Yep, Zach is down in Kane County, and he's with the Utah Arizona ATV Club, and they've got a fun run that's a lot of fun to go check out. Welcome back to At Your Leisure. Yep, we're down here in Bryce Canyon, just off Scenic Highway 12, and we're here near Red Canyon. That's what's in our background, and it is absolutely beautiful up here. It is spectacular. We're riding on Thunder Mountain Trail, and it goes through Red Canyon and all about. Yep, there's tons of mountain bike trails as well as ATV trails in this area, and there's lots of cool little campgrounds that we've been running into, so there's plenty of places to come down and camp and hang out and, and make a great weekend out of it. You bet, and it's easy to get to this trailhead. It's about two miles off of Scenic Highway 12, and you can drive a car clear up here or you can bike from there either way. Yep, and then once you get up to the trailhead then it turns into a really nice single track after that. And we've even found some trees that are slightly older than Chad up here. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> there are bristlecone pines and there's they're thousands of years old is what we're what told. we're told. Maybe we're fish heads, but <laughs> but it's pretty cool. But let's quit talking and get to riding.
road through Red Canyon was first built by CC camps back at, during the Depression years. The tunnels up through there were all done by those people. The campground that's up in the canyon was built by them. The biking trails, there's the one that you just you were on today. Thunder Mountain starts at the top and rides and comes to out, comes to out right over here. And then Los Higan Canyon and Castle Canyon both have bike trails and hiking trails. And we have different map, I mean different brochures on the trails. I don't know if you've been on Highway 12 all the way through, but as far as I'm concerned, it's the most beautiful highway in America. A lot of scenic outpoles, a lot of other things to see. It's a good start for a good ride. And I met a gentleman who had traveled the world out there, and I asked him, I said, have you ever seen anything like this anywhere else? He says, yes, one place. And I said, where? And he said, in Turkey. But he said it was only about a fourth of the size of what we're looking at here. He says, I've come back here and come back here because this is the only place like this ever anywhere. I had a gentleman today, he says, how am I going to see it all? And I says, I guess you make more than one trip. Well, we're just coming to the end of the Thunder Mountain Trail, and then we're going to have to ride up a little bit of asphalt to get back over to the truck. But uh, there is so many places to ride around here, not only on your mountain bike, but you could bring the kids along and ride the uh, asphalt trails. Plus, there's ATV trails all over the place. And speaking of trails, is that too corny? <laughs> <laughs> our it. next thing is going to our trailhead adventure, brought to us by RockyMountainATVMC.com. And that is Reese Stein, who is... Fishing around. Fishing around <laughs> in the community. Well, next week's show looks great. And so oh, does this. Oh, and so this does this pie. This yum. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, awesome. oh, great. Oh, yay. It looks beautiful. We're going to enjoy this. And you remember, go out and create your own adventure at, at your leisure. leisure. Well, if you're watching this, you probably... Sting it. Well, welcome back. No, not welcome back. <laughs> Welcome to At Your Leisure. Whoops. <laughs>